Well, right here in South Carolina, we too are above the recommended ratio of counselors to students. Our Lauren Thomas sat down with the president of the Palmetto State School Counselors Association to understand where we stand tonight. The more school counselors there are to be able to work with students, the better we're going to be at predicting who may need extra support. Anna Duval is the president of the Palmetto State School Counselors Association. We offer services to every student in our school, every student, and we offer them in three different domains, uh, the, the academic domain, the career, and also the personal social. And here lately, um, over the past couple of years, the demands of our personal social um, expertise has uh, exploded. Is that because of recent um, school shootings that we're seeing around the nation or more so social media or kind of all of that budding together and bullying and yes we're expected to be perfect in everything that we do we're expected to have perfect grades um, and that is taking a toll on the mental health of our students the need for more school counselors and mental health professionals is prevalent now more than ever the American School Counselor Association recommends no more than 250 students per one counselor but in South Carolina, the state mandated ratio is 300 students per counselor for grades 6 through 12 and 800 students per counselor for grades K through 5. The majority of schools in the Midlands fall within the state mandated ratio, but Duval says she's concerned with the elementary school numbers. Our students are coming to us with many more needs than they have in the past. And, and meeting those students' needs early is what I think will help us in the long run. As for why there aren't enough school counselors, Duval says it's always been that way, but now the demands are much more higher than before. They need support, and we need to be here to support them. In Lexington County, Lauren Thomas, News 19, WLTX. And Duval tells us the State School Counselors Association has met with lawmakers and superintendents over the need for more counselors but the demand is growing faster than their follow through. And it's unfortunately, it's not just counselors that are needed. As part of our investigation, we found 12,500 schools nationwide reporting zero mental health professionals on staff. You heard that right, not just zero counselors, but zero psycho psychologists and zero social workers as well.